Ever wondered what makes a TV series stand the test of time? Enter Police Story, a classic from 1973 that has solidified its place as a lasting symbol of the industry. With a simple narrative and a gritty portrayal of police work, this show hooks viewers in from the start. As you delve into the episodes, you'll uncover a roller coaster of emotions from amusing moments that leave you chuckling to surprising twists that defy expectations. The series doesn't shy away from the tough realities of police life, presenting a raw and authentic portrayal that resonates with audiences. Now, here's the kicker what makes police story timeless. What qualities does it possess that have made it memorable in television history? Share your thoughts below. Have you ever found yourself reminiscing about a cherished memory associated with the show? Perhaps a moment that stuck with you, making it more than just a TV series? We'd love to hear your stories and experiences in the comments below. So, grab your popcorn, settle in, and get ready for a journey through the highs and lows of Police Story. There's more to discover, and we want to hear from you. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this show? Share away, and let's keep the conversation going. Your stories make the show richer than ever. Police Story, the TV series that debuted in 1973, didn't just capture the essence of police work. It left a lasting impression on popular culture. Its reception during its time was remarkable. Audiences were drawn to its simple yet compelling narrative, immersing themselves in the gritty portrayal of police life. The show skillfully blended amusement and surprise, taking viewers on an emotional roller coaster with each episode. As the series unfolded, it didn't shy away from presenting the harsh realities of the law enforcement profession. This raw and authentic portrayal struck a chord with viewers, making it more than just a television show. It became a mirror reflecting the complexities of police life resonating with a diverse audience. The show's influence extended far beyond its original run. Spin-offs emerged, each exploring different facets of the criminal justice system. These extensions weren't mere derivatives. They enriched the overall narrative and provided viewers with a comprehensive understanding of the challenges faced by those in uniform. Merchandise tied to the series flooded the market, allowing fans to carry a piece of it with them. Action figures, clothing, and memorabilia became cherished possessions, turning the show into a tangible and integral part of fans' lives. The influence of the series wasn't confined to the small screen, it had become a part of everyday life. Adaptations inspired by the success of Police Story became a trend in the entertainment industry. Other shows sought to replicate its winning formula, hoping to capture the same magic that made it a cultural phenomenon. The ripple effect of its influence reached across genres, leaving an unmistakable mark on subsequent television productions. In the annals of television history, Police Story stands as an example of the power of authentic storytelling. Its impact on popular culture wasn't fleeting, it became a reference point for quality television. Viewers found themselves immersed in a world that felt real, where characters faced challenges that mirrored the complexities of life itself. As we reflect on the reception and influence of the series, it's evident that its significance goes beyond the confines of a traditional TV series. It became a cultural touchstone, influencing not just how we perceive law enforcement on screen, but also shaping the narrative of television as a whole. The show's lasting impact continues to be felt, reminding us that great storytelling has the power to transcend time. Incident in the Killing Zone, an episode of the 1973 TV series, featured Jan Michael Vincent, Alex Cord, and James Ferentino. Interestingly, this trio later reunited in two action shows, Airwolf and Blue Thunder, both centered around high-tech helicopters. Notably, Joe Santos, who had a role in a Police Story episode, also appeared in the movie Blue Thunder. Surprisingly, serial killer Edmund Kemper mentioned in an interview that the show taught him how to evade capture by the police. This revelation adds a chilling layer to the show's impact on real-life individuals and its influence on criminal behavior. Based on the real-life experiences of LAPD police officer Edward Taylor, the series delves into the gritty world of the Los Angeles Police Department. The show, with its raw and authentic portrayal of police life, goes beyond the conventional cop drama, leaving a lasting impression on popular culture. The show's influence goes beyond its initial run, spawning spin-offs that explore various facets of the criminal justice system. Fans embraced it not only through watching, but also by owning merchandise like action figures and clothing, turning it into a tangible part of their lives. 
in the grand scheme of television history, this series isn't just a show. It's a powerful example of authentic storytelling. Its reach extends beyond the small screen, shaping how we perceive law enforcement in media and influencing subsequent television productions. Police Story, born in 1973, courageously tackled societal issues of its time, navigating the tumultuous waters of police corruption, racial tensions, and the aftermath of the Vietnam War on returning veterans. The series ventured beyond the conventional cop drama, opting for a gritty and authentic portrayal of the Los Angeles Police Department's world. Notably, the show's opening theme, composed by Jerry Goldsmith, stands tall among the crime drama genre's most iconic and recognizable tunes. Its resonance lingered in the minds of viewers, adding a distinct layer to the show's impact. In a curious twist, Buster and Billy and Big Wednesday featured appearances by Jan Michael Vincent and Robert England, linking the actors to a broader spectrum of narratives beyond the police story universe. The influence of police story extended far beyond its original run. Spin-offs emerged, each delving into different facets of the criminal justice system, enriching the overall narrative. The show's impact wasn't confined to the small screen, it became ingrained in everyday life. Action figures, clothing, and memorabilia flooded the market, turning the series into tangible and cherished possessions for fans. Notably, serial killer Edmund Kemper's revelation that the show taught him evasion tactics adds a chilling layer to its impact on real-life individuals and criminal behavior. Rooted in the experiences of LAPD officer Edward Taylor, the series became a powerful example of authentic storytelling, shaping perceptions of law enforcement in media and leaving an indelible mark on subsequent television productions. Police Story wasn't just a show, it became a cultural touchstone, a reflection of life's complexities. Its enduring impact reminds us of the timeless power of authentic storytelling transcending the confines of its era. In 1973, Police Story made a notable contribution to television by presenting an unflinching portrayal of police work. The series stood out for its gritty and realistic approach, steering clear of the glamorous depictions found in other cop shows of that era. A unique aspect of the show lies in its syndication, where several two-hour episodes covering all season five segments and the television movies A Cry for Justice and Confessions of a Lady Cop were broadcast in two one-hour segments. This syndication approach made the series more accessible, allowing viewers to experience its impact in a condensed yet compelling format. What set Police Story apart even further was its ability to feature emerging talent in guest roles. Actors like Kurt Russell, Tom Selleck, and David Cassidy, among others, graced the screen before achieving stardom in their own right. This casting strategy not only added to the authenticity of the show, but also foreshadowed with the future success of these actors. In one episode, titled Incident in the Killing Zone, Jan Michael Vincent, Alex Cord, and James Farentino appeared. Interestingly, this trio later reunited in two action shows, Airwolf and Blue Thunder, both centered around high-tech helicopters. The connections between these actors across different projects add an interesting layer to the show's influence on their careers. In a chilling revelation, serial killer Edmund Kemper mentioned in an interview that the series taught him how to evade capture by the police. This unsettling connection to real-life criminal behavior underscores the show's impact on individuals beyond the fictional realm, serving as a stark reminder of its influence on societal perceptions. Born in 1973, Police Story transcended conventional cop dramas by courageously addressing societal issues of its time, from police corruption to racial tensions and the aftermath of the Vietnam War. The series navigated these turbulent subjects, contributing to its significance in the history of television. As we reflect on the syndication, guest appearances, and real-life impact, it becomes evident that Police Story isn't just a TV series. It reflects life's complexities, influencing both the industry and the audience it served. The show's gritty portrayal and unique casting choices have left a lasting impression on television, proving that authentic storytelling has the power to connect across time.